More than 1,000 neighbors in Davidson County are finding out this month they're going to have to buy pricey flood insurance. And News 4 Investigates has uncovered which sections of the county are being hit the hardest. Good evening, everyone. It is the latest development in our troubled waters investigation that exposes why people's homes are flooding that have never flooded before. Our chief investigative reporter Jeremy Finley found for many people it's a cost that will be difficult to manage. Do you really worry about your house ever flooding? No, not really. Marvin Smitty's Creek is often more dry than wet. When he bought this house 17 years ago, he didn't need to buy flood insurance. Were you surprised when you got the letter telling you that you're now in a floodplain? Yeah, yeah, that, that was, yeah, yeah, I was kind of stunned by that. In fact, here on Baker Road, more than 70 people will soon get this letter telling them they are now within the 100 year floodplain. The letters from the city follow a News 4 investigation that exposed new flood maps impacting more than a thousand properties examined by the Army Corps of Engineers and FEMA. We then obtained the addresses of those homes and our analysis found Goodlettsville with the highest number of people and businesses being notified their property is now at a higher risk of flooding. People in Nashville are receiving the second highest notification, then Jolton, and finally Ashland City. Mortgage companies will ultimately find this out too and will require flood insurance. Uh, the fact of the matter is we're being told that it's a moderate or high risk. They should probably not wait for the mortgage company because if there is a claim between now and then, unfortunately they're not gonna be covered. The cost could be between $450 a year to several thousand, depending on their flood risk and proximity to creeks. Yeah. Are you worried about how much this is going to cost you? That's my worry, because I'm on a fixed income, and every dime I had to account for. Meaning tough decisions have to be made when expenses, not water, are flooding in. Jeremy Finley, News 4 Investigates. Well, if you haven't received that letter yet and you want to know if you're now in a floodplain, we have that data on our website, WSMV.com. That's also where you'll find two years worth of stories in our troubled waters investigation.